summer day. And if the summer has gone by and you've always wanted to plant that garden, but just don't know how, well, you're in luck. There's an event going on this weekend by some of our locals that you could come take part in. It's absolutely free and get an education. Alfred Melbourne is joining us this morning with Three Sisters Gardens. Thanks for being here. Yeah, thanks for having okay, me. There is such a rich history in what you do. First of all, let's talk about who Three Sisters are. Uh, Three Sisters Gardens is a native indigenous-led 501c3 supporting the at potential high promise youth in Broderick, West Sacramento. Wow, that's fantastic. So your goal and your whole mission is to teach youth how to harvest, grow, respect Mother Earth, and get an amazing bounty like you have here. Yeah, we're trying to give them something positive to do, um, paying them to come out and work with us as interns and show them how to grow, harvest, and distribute organic vegetables to support the elders, women, and children in our community. That's fantastic. Let's start with some of what you brought because I could never grow anything like this. The colors are amazing and beautiful, and I can't believe this all came from right here. These look hot and spicy. They are, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, definitely. I everybody, shouldn't bite that. <laughs> no, no, I wouldn't bite that, but everybody loves a jalapeno sure. for salsa. Oh, salsa. Okay, and then this one? Altiplano Serrano pepper. Okay, fantastic. And these I can bite. What do I have? The colors are just so amazing. Yeah. I've never even seen a purple bell pepper. Can I just bite in it? You could. Oh, oh, okay. It's fresh. We okay. just harvested it today. Love mm, it. Look how crispy. Yeah. Mm, I have it. Mm, mm. Alfred, will you cut up the cantaloupe for us? Sure. So what you just bit mm. into was an mm -hmm. islander bell pepper. Okay. And we have some of our cantaloupe that we grow here locally. If you want to just go ahead and oh, grab that's that. Oh, so fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, you're going to love that for sure. Sweet. Oh, oh my yeah. goodness. How amazing. Okay. And then your tomatoes. I've been snacking on those all morning. Yeah, so we have the Sakura cherry mm. tomato. And then you have everybody's favorite. These are the citrine cherry tomatoes. And these actually have their own theme song, and that's Just Like what? Candy. Just Like Candy, just I love like it. Just Like Candy. Okay. <laughs> so tell me about tomorrow's event. It's called the Summer Skills Share. And people will learn, kids will learn about mini farm tours, they'll be seeding, bed turnover, transplanting. I don't even know what all those things are. Yeah, well, what we're trying to do is get people back to nature to teach these youngsters about growing and connecting with Mother Earth. So we're going to be putting on a, a summer skill share. There'll be a compost demonstration, nice. some turning over of beds, transplanting, some cilantro, and really kind of just letting folks get their hands back in the soil. Very nice. I love it. And you're also going to have cooking demonstrations, yes? Oh, yeah, yeah. So Are you going to be cooking? No, I'm oh. not. I'm going to be eating. I'll tell <laughs> you what. There you go. I'll be right so, there with you. Yeah, so um, we're going to have Chef Pau from Boca 671 come okay. out, and it's going to be a farm-to-fork meal. Yes. She's going to be a doing some awesome stuff for us, some chicken skewers. And, and where is this taking place again? Um, it's going to be at 317 Fifth Street in West Sacramento, California at Three That's Sisters nice. Gardens. I love it. Um, and so how can people come out and, and buy some of your produce as well? Yeah, so um, we sell at the Neighborhood Farmer's okay. Market. That's on Saturdays nice. from 8 to 1. We'll see um, you there. And yes, we'll see you at the Summer Share Scales tomorrow. Adam, look at this bounty. Can you believe that you can learn how to grow like this and harvest the best from Mother Earth? And we'll see you this weekend for it. There should be some good weather, right? Awesome. Yes, definitely. So Saturday looks like...